all right guys we are in yokohama station again it's raining really heavily up the top there so it's good to be down here in the station under the ground you can pretty much walk quite far around this area underground so i want to check out some of the waterfront area if i can uh, but this place is huge yokohama and i love how they've got all the like underground uh, malls and shops like that so a lot of people are not above ground because of the rain and you'll notice that when you come here to japan you'll go where is everyone and they're all down here down in the mall okie dokie guys so we are here and this is the sogo building which is here hey Nissan Motor Headquarters right there. Let's go check that out. Let's go check out the Research and Development Square from Fuji. Maybe even the Children's Museum. And they've got a waterside park. It is raining out there up top. But we can get to some of these places just walking underground here. Which is really, really handy. Okay, let's go for a walk. All right, guys, one cool thing you'll notice when you come here to Japan is outside some of the buildings, the malls, they have these things here. And basically, they're for wet umbrellas. If you have a wet umbrella, chuck your umbrella in here, like so, and it slides into a bag, pull your umbrella out, and there you go. Your wet umbrella is protected so you don't drip any wet on the ground in the mall. Pretty handy. Food, food, food. I mean, it's not the cheapest either. You're paying for real high quality food, as well as location and packaging and bright lights and a whole bunch of things. Anyway, guys, bunch of grapes here for around a thousand. Vien, which is about $15 New Zealand. That's not bad. Looks like two dollars a avocado. Yummy, yum, yum. Good for the tongue. All right, guys, we are at Nissan headquarters in Yokohama. It's the old skyline. Check out all these old school cars. The old Datsun. Remember Datsun? Well, this is the old school Sylvia. But check out the new school cars. The old Fair Lady Z. Beautiful. Wow, look at the engine. Amazing. V6 engine. Got it working inside. Wow. Looks like a transformer. Bumblebee transform. Oh, look, you can shift it, shift the gears. Let's go to that gear. What about reverse? Where's reverse? Back. Ah, that's pretty cool. Amazing. Ooh, one of my favorites the skyline and my favorite color blue how much is for this anyway let's check it out price list 12 12 million yen i think that's around 200,000 new zealand dollars that is beautiful damn that is beautiful another skyline Nissan GTR. Whoa. Big tires as well. Mm, look inside. Uh, price is very Amazing. expensive. Yeah. So I think the price of a house, you can buy a house for yes. for one of these. Small house. Would you like one of these? Yes, I like this. <laughs> I'm Korea. I'm in Korea and suddenly before selling left hand was a model. Ah, because Korea is right. 
uh, right side, yes. right. Yeah. Yes. Hmm. That's great. All the gears over here. Mm -hmm. It's like a rear rear wheel drive. Yes, all wheel drive, four wheel drive. <laughs> Oh, four-wheel drive, yeah, yes. four-wheel drive. Four -wheel yeah. four -wheel drive. Mm. Do you like miniature cars? Yes, I have collected this. Ah, you have collected them, ah. I'm right, I have it right now. Ah. <laughs> wow. In my back. Ah, you right have now. some, you bought some. Yes. Ah. <laughs> Korea, born in Korea. For Korea, yeah. Yes. In Korea, selling Tomica too, in this ah. corner. <laughs> what is the most popular car in Korea? Uh, Do you know? Or what is the most popular brand? Nissan? They like uh, Nissan? Nissan, Nissan and Infinity are popular too. Ah, Nissan and Infinity. But Hyundai Kia is very popular. Yeah. <laughs> Good for the family. Yeah. Oh, right. Let's have a look. Yes. US version. Yes, this US version. This guy. See you later. You, you can take it to Korea, okay? <laughs> bye bye. That is so old school. And this is like the pickup Ute version. Good for the farm. 1947. Ah, I think this is like the electric car, electric version. Power cells fueling the engine. Well, electrifying the engine, really, not really fueling it, but you get the idea. The E Power Train. All right, guys, we are in the Fuji Xerox Research and Development Building. Now, this building looks like an oval from the outside and it can withstand earthquakes which is really cool so i'm in it hopefully we get an earthquake so i can see if it does withstand an earthquake just joking anyway i've been having a look around this art gallery that they've got here in the fuji xerox building and basically it's got a lot of history about um, printing and about writing and it showed how some of the artifacts that they have here are from like seven thousand years ago um, from caves, um, human hands that have been um, put on walls, the prints have been put on walls, so these guys have like captured those prints and brought them back here. Now I couldn't film them because you're not allowed to film any of them. And then they've got things from Egypt, inscriptions from Egypt, inscriptions from Mesopotamian times, from Iran, uh, Sumeria, and a whole bunch of different things all to do with printing and writing uh, which is really cool and it's all in English as well so um, coming here is for free so if you are in Yokohama do come and check out this place it is the Fuji Xerox research and development building there's an art gallery here and a bit of chill out space and they've got a cafe as well so it's cool having a good pit stop here check that out guys and Panmen Children's Museum if any of you guys are into Ann Panman, I have no idea who Ann Panman is, but he's probably really famous with kids. Uh, this is the Children's Museum, right next to the Fuji Xerox building. Wow, it's really windy. Very, very windy. People getting selfies. Ann Panman. No idea who Ann Panman is, but this is pretty much. The Anpan Man Museum, stores, and I'm, I think, and I'm, and Pan Man friends. Cool to bring kids here, I guess. Kids will love this place. All the little merchandise. Whoa. The Unpound Man Toilets. Bit of a chill out area. What is this? Bit of a playground for all the kids. I think this is pretty cute. 
Konnichiwa. Photos for the kids. <laughs> It's pretty cool. All right, guys, we are in Yokohama and we are port side in a little area called Minato Mirai. Hope I got that right. Uh, and basically, it's made up of a lot of accommodation, business buildings. Very nice, tidy area, Yokohama. Beautiful. It's been a bit overcast today, guys. Wet as. But it's uh, finished raining and I'm just going for a walk around port side. I see a lot of Kiwis out because of the rugby. That game is tomorrow. And uh, ooh, it's cold as well. It reminds me of the New Zealand weather. <laughs> 